Hi guys. Thanks for loving our videos. Do like, subscribe and share. And don't forget to press the bell icon. And follow us on Facebook and Twitter where we upload one amazing fact every day. On our website www.scoof.com now you can start watching all such amazing videos for free. Take a free trial today. So, how do we get the names of different angles? Let's see. Alright, let's see. A 90 degree angle is called a right angle. Why? Because right is for right amount. And when we do something right, we get a thumbs up like this, which makes a right angle. Next is any angle between 0 and 90. It is called an acute angle, because acute means sharp or high, and angles between 0 and 90 are very sharp. For example, if somebody has an acute fever, the thermometer reading will be high. Angles between 90 degree and 180 degree are called obtuse angles. Why? Because they are not as sharp as acute angles, and that is what obtuse means, less sharp or low. As in a low fever, when we have a low thermometer reading. An angle of 180 degree is called a straight angle because the two arms of the angle make a straight line. And lastly, any angle between 180 degree and 360 degree is called a reflex angle. Why? Actually, reflex means a sudden movement or reaction. Reflexive means referring back to itself. For example, when we move our knee like this, we are doing a reflexive action and doing so, we are making an angle greater than 180 but less than 360. Hence the name, reflex angle. By the way, in English language too, reflexive means referring back to oneself, such as, I bought myself a t-shirt. Here myself is a reflexive pronoun. Alright, so this screen gives you the categorization of angles, bases their angle values. So. That is how we name different angles. Guys, we upload a video every week. So see you next Saturday. Go to www.scoof.com and take a free trial today. Alright, take care. Bye-bye.